Hello dear friends, let's talk about ink. So here's the ink stone, back side, front side, on the side side, side side side, side side side, <laughs> all sides. So we open up this ink stick also. So I will <clears throat> I will try to see how it works. This ink stick goes with ink stone, the size and everything. Okay, here's the ink. It will be too much scratching sound. I do not like it. So I usually just use um, Use a brush and dip in some water, for example, this water and dip in like this and get into this reservoir and do it. But today I decide to make my simple life complicated. How about I do it this way? So I soak my little <laughs> container in. Yeah, artist <laughs> is producing something useless. Yeah, they are producing something, but this is so useless. We can find so many easy ways, but uh, we intend to. It's beautiful sound. Loud. Okay, get some more water. Enough fun. Now we get to get back to our work. Okay, get some out and dry it with some tissue paper and wipe clean the table surface. Okay, another piece of sticky tape. Okay, clean up the table surface. Now here, this cup of water can go. Mm -mm. Table is a little bit dirty. I'm sorry. This table is dinner table, homework table. See, when I hold the hole, there is no air. The pressure inside and outside is insulated, separate, so no water comes out. Mm -mm. I do a tiny bit, a tiny bit, it comes out. Okay, this is enough. And I am messy enough already. So <clears throat> uh, here you can see the water drop does not move because this ink stone has put a layer of water. It just make it looks prettier. Actually, this oil <clears throat> You can wash it, use hot water to wash it, or you can use it just like this. I am lazy, so I do not want to wash it. And anyway, with use, this oil will go away. Now here, <coughs> I am soaking the ink stick a little bit, because right now the sound is not pleasant. It is too hard. Just to soak a tiny bit. I put it here. It's not easy to stand. Anyway, even this way will will be okay as long as there is some moisture there. It should be okay. I put it aside and show you some other ink stone. Okay, I have another piece of ink stone. <clears throat> Yes, here is the ink stone that I got in China. Uh, <coughs> I have sold out this. This is the last one or two. So this one does not use... Let me see it used... Yeah, it's also used uh, oil to, to protect it, make it smooth a little... make the smooth a little bit more pleasant. Otherwise, there will be a lot of powder or dust of the stone. By grinding the stone, there will be a lot of dust. Anyway, the new ink stone 
the water does not move smoothly, does not move. It stays together because there is an oil protection. Okay. Here we come back to our ink stick and I will do the grinding. It is a little bit soaked, so, oh yeah, it is very soft. And because this ink stick, the size is relatively small, and if you use this way, it is quite pleasant to grind the ink. And still there are some parts quite hard, so I still leave it a little bit to let it soak and show you my larger ink stick. So this is my usual ink stone and ink stick. But only until next year, I, uh, no next year, only two months later I go to China, then <coughs> I can get it. But this ink stone is so heavy. Imagine I buy a few of it, the luggage will be heavy enough and then I cannot buy pretty clothes, I cannot buy, um, buy the bees, the books, and uh, so I, I really do not want to do this as a business. I take back a few and uh, mostly if you find the ink stone you buy here uh, much more expensive than you buy in China. It is true because the shipping does cost a lot of money. And if you go overseas shipping by a shipping company, it may get break. So shipping is the problem. The brush is very heavy. I can buy 200 brushes and uh, and. Uh, still not too heavy, but one ink stone is already too heavy. So this is also why it is expensive. And uh, I do not do sales on ink stone. It is just too much work. And um, I do not do special discount on ink stone. Ink stone is, uh, is quite a, a business of a, of a lot of labor, but very low. Um, very low in, in profit. Anyway, let's do not talk about business to destroy our our elegant taste. Okay, so this because this ink stone I am selling this ink stone and ink stick as one set, kind of one set, and then you can see the small ink stick goes very well with this small ink stone. If you have a large ink stick, it will be quite uncomfortable to grind it. You feel like a, like a giant Michael Jordan wearing the, the mini skirt of uh, Angelina Jolie. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, it's like there is no room for you to, to move on and it's not that comfortable. So if you have a small ink stick like this, it works actually quite well. And I am planning to buy one, two, three, four. I, buy, I plan to buy 30 or 40 this ink stone and ink stick. So each of my students, when they take art class, they can, they can use it and grind their own ink. They like it. It is a lot of fun. It's quite meditative. Or you can grind this way, this way, yeah. So this ink stone, ink stick, still not yet totally softened, so the sound is not so pleasant. And also I pressed quite 
quite strong. Okay, sorry. Okay, let me do it in the right direction. Okay, the good thing of this ink stone is also there is a reservoir, and you grind, push it down, get some new, and continue. It's quite a smart design in a way. Okay, here let's talk about the ink uh, ink stick. This ink stick and ink stone, they are all made in China. Even if they are um, sold in Japanese shop, but mostly they are made in China. And um, Japanese traders or Chinese traders have made this a supply chain management <laughs> logistic, international business logistic. And China made the material, made the ink, and Japanese se sells. And uh, this is of Japanese style ink stone. So it's this long, long one. But the stone is from the same place in China. And the ink stick also. Here is one thing. This ink stick we see is quite, uh, it's, it's not cracking. And sometimes we see the ink stick cracks very much. There are several reasons for it. One reason is that, uh, <coughs> uh, okay, let's talk about the inks, ink stick's composition. It's the charcoal powder, it's the pigment powder plus some binding and this binding includes something like uh, gum arabica or some other stuffing material stuffing so that it becomes this kind of a stick like and you grind it the color comes out and gum arabica or whatever or peach um, glue whatever it is a kind of color pigment plus glue, okay, in the most comfortable, most understandable way to say it's color plus glue and make into such a paste. And uh, <clears throat> this, my information is by no means authentic. I am not authentic at all. I checked internet and found this information. And Chinese ink, our, <clears throat> uh, I heard, I checked from internet and, and knew that Chinese ink usually have a certain proportion of, uh, of the color and the glue, the, the pigment, the black, and the glue, the, the gluing um, agent. And Japanese ink, usually they like to have uh, less glue, less agent, and more ink. So this way, the, the Jap Japanese sumie ink or Japanese ink is more watery and less oily. It has more transparency in it. Um, I do not yet understand very well on this part. It just uh, I heard the information and I feel this information does make sense. So I transfer this information all I know to tell you all I learned. And for this reason and a lot of Japanese order a uh, uh, place order to Chinese factory to Chinese ink stick factory, then it becomes a kind of a la mode, a kind of a trend that we use less of the bonding and more of other stuff, more of this ink. So this is the reason why some of the ink stick get cracked, right? If you have a more portion of that agent and stuffing and uh, and glue of course the ink stick get complete piece more easily if you have less glue 
it becomes cracking more easily. Okay, this might be the reason that your ink stick get cracked. If you have a, a pure, good quality ink stick and it comes out beautiful color and the color comes out very easily but got cracked to several pieces, I think, I guess, the reason is that they are not putting a lot of uh, a lot of uh, glue and uh, so that the color comes out easily and also with the temperature change uh, uh, things may the, 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 the ink stick uh, with so much temperature change it may uh, um, temperature and moisture change its internal bonding uh, Comfortness, what do I say? Change too much, suddenly become too dry, then it it cracked up. So that that might be the reason. You see here there is crack because I use the ink stick, ink stick, and uh, there is water on it. Of course, I grind it in the water, and when it's getting dried, it's cracked. Yes. And uh, <clears throat> if it is completely cracked, yeah, it might be because uh, temperature change, moisture, uh, moisture density change, and not enough glue, not enough bonding. So, a uh, ink stick crack or not does not represent the quality of the ink stick. The quality of the ink stick is in its refineness of the of the, the 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 ink stick of the surface, and this one is such a beautiful surface. Good things speaks itself. I always believe this, and you see, this is a good ink stick. You hold it and. You have this love for it, and you know it's a good, decent, elegant piece of ink. And this one is also a decent ink stick. And some, um, some ink stick, you just know that you feel it does not look good without a good workmanship. And, and uh, and uh, not caref carefully executed and uh, material was uh, not pure but this ink stick is a decent one and this one is uh, such a beautiful one i always enjoy okay another friend asked what comes how comes what <coughs> ink oh, wow this is so smooth right now and this ink stick right now is becoming so pleasant. I remember when I was young, when I was in, um, when I was, I think I, I started writing calligraphy at four years old. Four years old, everybody in my family has to write one page of newspaper, one newspaper page of calligraphy. Yeah. Okay, um, <clears throat> One friend asked, how about you grind ink to reach to this gold, to reach to this gold? Okay, first of all, this is not gold. It's, um, it's golden coloring. It comes, it might come from metallic, real metal, bronze or something, very refined mesh, very refined bronze powder and put it here and uh, and become a kind of gold paste. We see a lot of golden coloring. It might be just a coloring. And it's such a little teeny tiny teeny tiny percentage of the ink stick. And when you grind it, you grind it into from teeny tiny little small particle into 
even teeny tiny, teeny tiny, teeny tiny, teeny tiny, 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 that smaller particle. So the color does not change. And um, oh, now the sound is becoming quite good. So <clears throat> I think. Uh, this explains a lot. Sometimes still these ink sticks you can you can hear some I will not talk. Did you hear? There is some very tiny scr scratching sound. That is not. Uh, that is the impurity of the ink stick, and that might be a, a larger particle of the the pigment or some sand or dust in it. But this one relatively is good quality, so it does not happen. Hear it. Sometimes I scrape it with uh, with a knife and get that particular one piece of uh, one piece of sand out and it will be good. But uh, <coughs> for this price, we get an ink stick like this is usable and decent and it's okay. And this one, this one is much better than, than that. But still, it is very difficult to make it purely, completely no no impurity. It is just natural to have some impurity. As long as it's not like sandpaper scratching, then it is okay. And uh, all I want to say is that this ink stick is a decent ink stick. It, it, is, um, it is a good buy it was every cent of it, and I'm selling it not too expensive. And the ink stone, and with this, your life will be so much easier. And uh, there are uh, ink stone, no, uh, there are bottled ink. If you are international, I cannot ship to you, and bottled ink, it just. Uh, not easy to ship and very heavy shipping fee is expensive so if you can have this set of ink and ink stone your life will be very much easier elegant and enjoyable sorry and blah 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 so long let me enjoy i will